So I think preachers are really lucky because we get to write sermons every week or every other week. And um, that has become such a central place of my script of my spiritual life it has become so central to my spiritual life that I open the scriptures and I don't just read them and I don't just have quiet time, but that I actually wrestle with them on the page. Um, not all people who are preachers are intuitively writers, but I think a lot of us are. And for those of us who fall into that camp, preachers who are also writers, it is the process of wrestling the text on the page, as Harry Emerson Fosdick once said, I think on paper. Um, for me, I, I write my way toward and into that moment at which I say, oh, this is what this sermon wants to be about. I will never get there just thinking about it. I won't get there talking to clergy friends about what the lectionary is. And sometimes that happens um, relatively seamlessly. It is, however, not uncommon that I write two other sermons that are about the same text but about different points before I write my way toward what the sermon wants to be. Um, and I'm willing to trust my intuition about that. I will say um, that it is harder for me to trust my intuition when I haven't left myself very much time. And um, in my preaching life, there is a pretty clear correlation between the amount of time I have devoted to preparing the sermon and how well the sermon seems to preach on Sunday.